Can both of you just stop for a sec? Look, Andrew, if he doesn't want to answer the question, that's fine. We don't need to the press him on that. The only person who misses oh, Wilson. Oh, go put, go, 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 let me move it on. I'm done anyway. I'm done anyway. Yeah, listen, 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 go put your fake kids to sleep, yeah? God, right, God bless. Weren't you about to rage quit? Weren't you about to show me? Yeah, get the out of here. That's right. Absolutely nasty work. And you guys are in an open relationship. You guys have been dating for three months and you guys do content together. Yes. Okay. You do content together and you're, you're in a poly open relationship where you're dating other men romantically and you're dating other women no. romantically. No, no, it's just sexual, sexually open. Oh, for, for the content. Sexually open for the content, yes. So you're not, not romantically, but sexually you do see other people. Yes, sexually. And you will sleep with them together. Yes, and I will marry Sophia. Oh, day. you're going to marry her. Yes. Okay. So you're, you guys are going to get married. You've been dating for three months. You guys produce. I'm Let trying. Me. I try not to talk past anybody. My bad. You guys are in a relationship yourselves, like a romantic relationship yes, between oh, each other. Yeah, openly we sleep with other people as well, but romantically we're together, yes. Oh. Okay, so you consider her your girlfriend, but you don't consider other girls your girlfriend. You just consider other girls girls that you sleep with. Yes. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. So you are a cuck. Yes. The final cuck, please. What? A cuck is a person who purposely allows their women to get f***ed by other men. That's, yes. Uh, for money, yeah. Yeah. The money no, doesn't I mean, take away from it, my G. This is a question and answer. Are you or are you not? Yes or no? Yes, you are. Now, if you wasn't in a relationship with her or talking about marrying the young lady one day and you're still making money off of her, that would make you a pimp, right? <laughs> it's a, there's a fundamental difference. All right, let's keep going. In, wait, wait you wouldn't <laughs> let her sleep with other men if they weren't paying her? No, they're not paying her. Let's get that right. We make content. We get paid for content. So... Yes, we involve other people because it makes more money. And again, that's why I allow it. Again, romantically, Ooh. yes, when we're 30 years old with a child and we slow down with all the money we've got in the bank, we can live happily ever after. So, yes. So you do let other men fuck your woman on purpose, Yeah, and right? she lets me fuck other women. Sure, sure. I, I understand that. Yeah. But you would be a cuck, correct? I just don't like you that just don't saying, like it. but okay. uh, we do it for I mean, feelings. I'm sure you don't, but I mean, that's what a cuck is, is somebody who lets another band purposely their woman yes. right that's a cuck yeah if i'm a cuck i'm, I'm a cuck yeah I'm, I'm, i don't think andrew's trying to insult you i think he's not, not. i'm just trying to is. clarify it again i don't not. is what it is isn't it again we we're young we're probably in a better position than you was when you was 23 again no throwing shade but i just don't feel like being a slave to a religion is going to get you anywhere in life it's good praying it's good doing your thing but i just want to live life at her money and be yeah happy. i mean now for context this gentleman on the left is andrew wilson now if you remember i did a video on the fresh and fit podcast not too long ago it was titled something like fake tough guy or emotional man challenges family man this is the same guy. So when this cuck dweeb is referencing not caring about religion, he's talking about Andrew's religion. Now, what's interesting about what the weak man just said is, is that he's going to get to 30 years old and just live happily ever after with his woman that had her back broken by BBCs all over the world. And that's not the way that anything works. No matter how much money, you could be a billionaire, but your wife was still used and desecrated for filth. Religion aside, don't you understand that? Way better to let people fuck your old lady. All self-respecting yeah. men do that. Yeah, but sex is just sex. Again, I think it's like you, you take money it Money is just money. Yeah, yeah, but- Yeah, but money gets you places. Money gets you places, sex, sex don't. Where does money get you? Mon money, but Does it get you to a place where other men fuck your old right. lady? Yeah. Is that where it gets you? Yeah, yeah it takes me on flights. It takes me to buy a house, it takes to buy a house, it takes me to buy a car, it takes me to buy the jewelry I've got on, it takes me to buy the clothes I've got on. So if and I believe in God and I'm poor, that's really point? expensive money to allow the person that you're in love with to get dishonored by right. other men. We enjoy don't you it. Think? You enjoy uh -oh. why the, you okay, so now we're in a different level. So you enjoy the fact that your old lady gets I by enjoy the sex, she enjoys sex, other people enjoy sex, so why not let's just have fun? I'm, yeah, I'm, so got, do you enjoy the fact that she's getting humped by other men? I don't yes. enjoy it. We just do what? it. We get on with it. We have fun. Yeah, yeah, right. I enjoy it. Yeah, I do enjoy it because it's. You do enjoy it. Yeah, I enjoy it. Yeah. I don't even yeah. know. Do you ever watch it? Do you ever go? Do you ever watch other dudes plow your chick, dude? I don't watch the videos back, but in the action, I'm watching. Yeah, it's, it's quite it's horny, to be honest. So you you get off to it? Well, it's horny. Yeah, in in the act. Yeah, if I'm <laughs> sleeping with someone else and she's sleeping with someone else, and yeah, it's just horny. It's just it sounds nice. like you're the slave. No. Am I tripping or does it seem like dudes that think like this have been surging within media as of late? Dudes who are into this weirdo type of shit but offset 
what's happening by being able to make a bag off of it. The only way I can try to explain this is just the popularization of easy to view hub sites by men everywhere. And it's sort of like the more that you watch that type of content, the more that is normalized because what you're watching is a dude bang another woman. And that's only two stone throws away from that other woman being your girl. Gentlemen, do understand that we've all been brainwashed with the propaganda with the media today to think certain ways. And if you overconsume corn, we already understand that the forces that be want you to be a weak man. And you don't also think that the propaganda is rearing its ugly head in corn? It absolutely is, and cases like this prove it. Stay focused. Uh, yeah. Sounds like I'm free and you're the slave. Huh. You know what I never have to worry about? Your wife getting banged? I never have to worry about another dude f***ing my old lady at my behest right. because I'm not a slave to it's my money. lust. And I never have to worry about the fact that I can make an honorable buck because I'm not a slave to the money mm. either. It sounds like you're the slave. Nah. It sounds like I'm the one who's mm. free. <laughs> Great point. Nah. Nah, definitely not. Again, I was a slave when I'd done my demolition. I was getting up at stupid o'clock, getting paid stupid lights. And then, yeah, now, now I'm living life. I'm doing social media full time. I do content yeah, full time. I've got a beautiful man, woman right? by my side that I'm going to marry and have kids with one day. And yeah, if if we enjoy sex, why not? Well, what's the big deal? Sex is sex. Adam and Eve had sex. So oh no, we didn't. Well, I didn't say that sex is the big deal. The big deal is whether or not you have what is considered virtue and honor. Other Who men cares about honor in ten years' time? Well, I'm going to explain uh, it to you. Men so, do. If you want the answer. Yes, Karen. Other men are always going to see you as a cuck. They're going to see you as less than a man. And the reason they're going to see you as less than a man is because you purposely allow other men to bone your chick. Yeah. So because they consider this to be low virtue, they're always going to consider you to be lesser than them, no matter how poor they are. The poorest man on this planet is always going to consider himself richer Chitans than you. Chitans literally help a 95 donated $200. Andrew is the perfect example of modern Christians, cherry-picking what he follows of God's word based on his own opinions. Treats everyone he disagrees with awful. Berates belittles, insults. I haven't belittled anybody. In fact, we've just been arguing our various points. There's no belittlement. Right now we're engaged in what's called an argument. Yeah. So I'm explaining to you that the poorest what's man... What's hilarious about that is the t title of his name is Satan's Little Helper. But at least at this junction, I don't see anything that he's doing as berating or belittling. He's just telling him the truth. As men, at the core of it, all we have is respect. And he's forming an opinion about that, and he's giving a life lesson, a public life lesson to someone who's in the public light for doing this. That the poorest man on planet Earth who has a virtuous wife who is loyal to him is always gonna consider himself richer than any amount of money that you give yourself based on the fact that you let other men bone your chick. You understand that, right? Yeah, but again, you, you're saying poorer, but again, if I'm making money and we enjoy it, what is the problem? I don't care what anyone thinks. I'll get death threats well, on the daily. Well, the, I don't, the I don't care. Is, yeah, right. So, I mean, if you don't care about virtue, if you are a slave to your own sin, your own vice, then you're in what's called pre -lest. And the thing is, is that shaking you out of pre less is next to impossible. You have now told me multiple times, the thing which you value in life, the only thing which you value is money. Yes. After all, God's not going to feed you. He's not going to clothe you. He's no, not he going to take care of you. He won't. Though there's uh, almost every other thing on planet Earth you could do to make money. You took the easy path to make yeah. money and will. you shared the one thing that men never share, which is their woman, in order to do it. That's okay. why all men everywhere will always consider you lesser than they are. Was or your, than, you, than they are, yeah. Was your, are you married? Is yeah. That, yeah, was your wife a virgin when you met her? No. No, so she's probably been shagged by a lot of dudes. So what's, what's no, the difference? No, she hasn't been shagged by a lot of dudes. How many, how many dudes has she shagged before you? Well, we have five kids. And the thing is, is that she shagged less people than she has kids. Yeah. And on top of that, let me ask you a question. If every single person that your chick slept with got her pregnant how many kids would you have you do realize most women lie about the body counts so that your wife probably has banged quite a few more people than what no she hasn't so but again you don't know the question that's, that's, here's here's the question the question is how many kids would you have if every time you banged a new dude you got pregnant how many kids would you have we were rubbers so that we wouldn't yeah i know that's not do you, you understand what a hypothetical is if 
if it if. were true that. So if it were true that every time you slept with a dude, you got pregnant, how many kids would you have? I thought we don't keep count. We Damn. So what? I mean, would, would, I would that, that we... studio be a nursery right now? Would it require Does that matter, uh, five or six full-time care workers to take care of all the kids that were in there? Is has that this, how many kids you would have? How's this relevant, may I ask? What's that? How's this relevant? You're going on about nursery well, kids. Well, it is relevant. Imaginary babies. You're, you're, like, trying to make, you're trying to make an accusation that somehow because my wife was not a virgin when I married yeah. her, and you're that's incredible to me allowing other men to fuck my wife. And clearly yeah. it's not. It clearly, <laughs> clearly there's a distinction in virtue. Yeah, but your wife's been fucked. So, okay, okay. again, without being crude, I, I do have respect for you, but your wife <laughs> mm -hmm. has been fucked before you. So why does it matter? It's interesting hearing her speak after watching her look so disinterested <laughs> As her boyfriend is getting ripped to shreds. But her body language says everything. She's barely defending him. She's not even following up on the beautiful relationship that they have, that they're gonna have all of these kids and a happy family. Her body language is screaming that she wants nothing to do with you after her run of content is over. Meanwhile, you over here talking about you wanna get married to her after three months. This, ladies and gentlemen, is what a weak, pathetic man looks like. Yeah, so what? What what yeah, so what with me? So what? She sleeps with other do men. Do I do there. I go and let other men f my wife not, on purpose? No. You might you get do that. You might get you it let up, let mate. Other men, you let <laughs> you might other get men up. stick their junk in your chick's mouth and then you uh, kiss her the next day, bro. Yeah. She loves it. Yeah. And I love it. And you think that that's equatable to the fact that my wife wasn't a virgin when we got married? Yeah. I wasn't a virgin either. Yeah. See, so I don't get it's your, the same. your point. Oh, it's the same. It's just like it's just like letting other random strangers plow your chick. Yeah. <laughs> it's the same. Again, <laughs> I'm a Gen Z, and you're you're old fashioned. Again, I've probably made more money than you was when oh, you were younger. Oh yeah, it's younger, real old so. fashioned to not let other men stuff your chick. What an old fashioned, <laughs> stodgy cares? old man I really am. Who that cares? was an old fashioned, stodgy son of a bitch. <laughs> Who cares yeah, in don't 10 years? I let other dudes stuff my chick. Who, what a, who cares I'm in just, 10 years? You know, I'm a real fuddy duddy. I'm a real fuddy duddy. No, but who, again, going back, who cares in 10 years when it's Your all children. forgotten about and we're living a happy life in a lovely mansion, It ain't going to be forgotten about. It no one's ever going to forget about. that you're a cuck. You came on one of the God largest damn. IRL podcasts on planet Earth and told the world you're a cuck. No one's yeah, ever going to forget it. that, bro. Love it. Subscribe to Sister Bella. That? When your kids, when your kids if you cock. ever have them get old, they're going to come back and they're going to be like, little Johnny's going to be in the schoolyard and school dude's going to walk over. Kid's going to walk over. He's going to be like, look, your dad's a fucking wow. cuck, Johnny. And you're going to be like, well yeah, that's true. I, I did allow other men on purpose to your mother, Johnny, but that's because I'm a real man. Yeah, well, I Johnny, care about money. Right. To say money is everything and act like there's no consequences to this while also acknowledging that your future kids may have access to this content and to get bullied. Meanwhile, kids are unaliving themselves because of their parents' past OF or corn decisions that get brought out to them via the local school bully. This dude is completely disassociated from reality. So Andrew continues to pressure him until he can't handle it and storms off of the podcast. So let's watch that right now. The question is, how many 18 plus year olds have you heard say my parents effed the whole country? And I'm not as, <laughs> is this a rhetorical this, question? I think this applies to Brandon. Okay, so that was pretty crazy. But I mean, the, the question applies, right? So Brandon, how many people who are in your industry who have children, whose children are proud of them, that they share their wife around or vice versa? You love coming back to me. Yeah, you? Andrew. And, well, the question Andrew. was directed at you. Andrew, the brother, big listen. God. Go to church the on question go was to church on Sunday. You, Brandon. Go to church on Sunday. Do your praying. Be your slave, and let's carry on. Because I'm I'm tired. I'm jet lagged to fuck. I've got. Don't a headache, be a you know? wimp, dude. Just Don't answer the question the super chatter asked you. Oh the super God. chatter's asking oh this question because he wants to know what your answer is. Uh, to what? Sum that up very quickly. <laughs> so so his, his question is, how many? of the people you know inside of this industry yeah. who allow their wife or significant other to be shared or are engaged in porn That's have children who are proud of them. That's what the intent of his question is. It, listen, I'm saying this once and we're cracking on. We're in a Gen Z. We can make money multiple ways. I don't know anyone that's had children that do You're what You're not we answering do. the question. Uh, the question is how many of those children are proud I of I don't know any children. So let's move on. Thank you very much. You're not going to answer the question? I don't know any children. How many times have I got to say? He's not answering. Yeah, I know you don't have children. That's not what the question was. Me. Listen to what the question is. <laughs> How many of these people in this industry that you deal with who have children, whose children are proud of them? Have you checked on your wife? She might be getting <laughs> at the minute. Now, are you going to answer my 
Quite no, bro, move you're on, bro. I'm piss you're pissing me off, bro. Just move on. Yeah, I don't care if I'm pissing wait, you off. Bro, you bro, yeah, bro, bro, wait, fuck. Oh, well, Andrew, shut your mouth bro. and answer the fucking question. Fuck off. Go pray. Wait, you Andrew, yeah. fuck off. If he doesn't answer fuck the fuck off. Question. Andrew, if he doesn't want to answer, fuck off, off bro. Wait, Andrew. You're God, Bob, bro. You're fucking boring from the start, you prick. Wait, wait, guys, 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 guys. No, fuck off. Are you gonna go cry with your wife who gets by other dudes? Are you gonna go cry with her? He doesn't have to answer the question. You're gonna go cry? You're gonna go cry? You're gonna go cry? Your wife's getting f***ed. Your wife's getting f***ed. Your wife's getting f***ed. Kids up. You're a father to your father to other people's child. No, bro. I'm backing myself. I'm backing myself. No. Your wife. Your wife. Your wife's getting right now. Stop being a You're gonna rage quit. Rage quit. No, because I'm bored of your god shit, bro. I'm got. I'm bored of your god shit. There's no disrespect, but he's boring me to fuck me. Look, I've got a better thing to do in LA. Look. Yeah, you're gonna go hold suck. On. What? You got better things to do? You're gonna go have your Andrew, life get hold on. You got money to make. Fucked. Yeah, your, your missus gets fucked on the Wait, daily, mate. Yeah, Don't yeah, worry. The only person gets fucked around here is your missus. Yeah, yeah, we love it. Men know how to be friends, right? Yeah, seriously. Men know how to be friends. Love it. Love it. Love it. Can both of you just stop for a sec? Look, look. Andrew, if he doesn't want to answer the question, that's fine. We don't need to the press him on that. The only person who misses Oh, Wilson. go put, go, 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 let me move it on. Done it, Andrew. Let Brian, I'm done anyway, yeah. Listen, 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 Earth, go put your fake fuck. kids to sleep, yeah. Weren't God night, God bless. Weren't you about to rage quit? Weren't you about to show me? Yeah, get the that's right. Absolutely nasty work. Imagine trying to insult your opposition with the same thing that you publicly admit that you do, which is giving your wife away. Andrew absolutely deserves a round of applause for fighting debauchery. And that's what this world needs. A lot more degeneracy fighters to combat against those that live in a state of delusion, free of consequences, or so they think. So the dude actually comes back later in the show and admits something. Andrew, yeah, I just want to say, I've got your rope, brother, yeah? Me and Sophia, I can't even understand what you're saying. No, 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 listen, English. Listen. I can you speak listen. English, limey? English, English. Nobody English. can even understand what you're saying. Listen. Talk, talk real slow. Listen, I've come on here, I've pranked you. Listen, me and Sophia are in a solid, normal relationship. We're not in Where an open she relationship. Gets fucked by other men? No way, she doesn't, funny enough. I've pranked you all. Subscribe to Sister Bella. She pays my holidays. She pays for everything. Big up the sugar mamas. Big up Sister Bella on OF, yeah? I'm going to live my life. Okay. You crack on all with right. God. Right. Have a good one. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Peace. It was nice meeting you. What's the, I don't understand, what's the troll? The troll is that, that they they're, they're not in an open relationship, Please I guess. Oh, okay. I don't even understand the troll. Why would you pretend that your girl got fucked by other men? <laughs> I, don't, I don't even understand that. And that's the point, because it's not a troll. He was so successfully embarrassed and shamed for his debaucherous and egregious behavior that he had to come all the way back in the room to tell the world that he was trolling. But yeah, I absolutely side with Andrew in this conversation right here complete and utter decimation and i think that he's a thousand percent right for calling out degenerate behavior this was an interesting one right here questions comments concerns y'all already know what to do me go to turtles and reviews at gmail.com what you guys think about the clip that i have for you guys today give me your comments down below and i'll see you guys soon until next time youtube peace, peace.